country here. Now, today I am off to Melbourne with my friend Samantha. Hello. So, my friend Samantha has never been before. I've been once before and I really, really, really like going to the island. My neighbours, they have a caravan over here and they come quite a lot. Um, I wish I had a caravan, but I might do that one day, but you never know. So today I'm going over to Melport with Samantha. Melport is just over there. This fair takes about 10 minutes and we're going to explore. We have bought or hired Belial bikes, they can go um, from large train station. We'll see you later. Bye. Hi everyone, so we are now on Melport um, and we've just seen a seal. I don't know if you can see it, but it's literally just down there uh, where my finger is out. Yeah, where my finger is, it's about there. So this seal um, we just noticed and we're having a lot of fun. Um, my friend Samantha has binoculars, which she is doing, uh, playing with. Um, and there's lots of cars just passing now at this place. There's lots of cars just passing because the ferry's probably just come in. Have a look around. So let's have a look and see. Oh wow. Beautiful. Oh wow. Well, that's quite cool. Thanks. So, cool. so I've just looked through Samantha's binoculars and they are awesome. That seal looks awesome. Um, don't get me wrong, there's not a lot of cars here. That's probably because the ferry's just been and cars are going into Millport, uh, the town. But look at this view, this view is amazing.com. I would love to live here. Uh, this is where I'm going to retire. I've said it live on YouTube. This is where I'm going to retire. <laughs> this is where to find you in about 70 years. Yeah, uh -huh. And I could be the new pudgy cleaner. Yep, so I'm going to go, we've got bikes, we managed to get bikes from the uh, Barracks train station, uh, they are bike and go bikes, they are the Abelio bikes, the Abelio bikes um, from Abelio the train company, now here is the local town bus just about to pass, um, which meets the ferry every time the ferry comes in, so one bus serves the whole island, and goes between Ferryport and Millport Town Centre. Um, and the idea of the bus is it meets uh, passengers coming off the ferry and takes passengers to the ferry and there's, and there's no delay, uh, it will definitely get there. So that seal is literally still here. So I'm now going to go and um, we're going to go some more geocache and we'll just find one geocache and I'm about to go and find more. So I'll see you all later. So there is Mr. Seal, Mr. Melport, the seal, sunbathing, floating around the water. <laughs> Look how close it is to us. Wow. We could literally be here all day. Here comes Samantha! Way! Yeah, so we are in Melport now. This is actually the town. Uh, I know everyone calls the island Melport, but the island's called the Isle of Cumbria, and we are now in the wee town of Melport. Uh, this is a bus stop shelter thing, full of graffiti, um, well, hearts and stuff. Um, so we're now going to go into Melport town 
uh, probably grab a drink, hot drink, and have uh, some of our picnic. So I will check in with you a little later on. Bye bye, see you later. Yay. We have just stopped off at a beach. Um, we're almost in the town centre. We are in the town of Melbourne now, on the island of Cumbria. And um, we're just stopped off for a wee drink. And there's lots of dog walkers, people with um, wheelchairs, buggies, all sorts. And we just saw like a chuckle vision bike. Um, if you don't know what a chuckle vision bike is, I'll comment below and let you know. Um, basically, it's like I was going to hire it with my friend Samantha and our friend husband, but it's ten pound an hour. It'll cost you about, I would say, a nearly about 50 quid to go around the island um, on one of these bikes. So, no, no thanks. Um, I don't want to. So, we, we're happy with our Belial bikes here. Um, so, we are currently, there's plenty of cyclists cycling around town, which is amazing um, for March. So, we're going to go now and we're going to make our way into town and have some lunch. We've brought some picnic with us. So, we're going to eat that and then go more cycling and chill cash. We are now at the famous Crocodile Rock. Yes, this is, if you can see it right by me, woo, this is a famous rock in Melport called the Crocodile Rock. Don't know much about it, but this rock is famous and it's always a thing that people want to get photos of when they're here in Melport. So that's Crocodile Rock. It's currently surrounded by water, so you can't actually go on it. Now I'm on like a wee pier thing just now, uh, a wee pier. Um, so I'm slowly walking up now. There is, just behind me, some toilets, rock, crocodile rock toilets. Now they're looked after a lady called Suki, or Sucky. Suki more like. Um, sorry if I didn't pronounce your name right, I'm, I do apologise. Um, she is known as the Cumbri Kudgy Cleaner. And she does bog vlogs. So just like me, but she calls them bog vlogs. So check her out on Facebook and on YouTube. She is the North Ayrshire citizen of the year. So we're here at Crocodile Rock having a lot of fun this evening or this afternoon and we're going to probably go get a hot drink, have something to eat and then make way back to Largs. So this is Crocodile Rock. Well we are now on our way back to the ferry port. We made it halfway around, we got as far as Millport Town Centre Melbourne Town Centre and then basically we went and had something to eat at the Ritz Cafe that was really nice and we're now cycling back to the ferry port the way we came. When I come again in April I'm going to cycle the whole way around. And there is Samantha, she's walking because our legs are tired. So that's Samantha. Um, so we're going to make our way back to the ferry port and probably get the 5pm ferry. So probably next time you see me we'll be on the ferry. So we've really enjoyed today. I think Samantha's really enjoyed her first visit to um, Melport. I certainly have enjoyed my second ever visit and I'm definitely going to come back here more than once this year. Um, so I'm now going to take this bike and now we need to take back to Largs train station um, and dump it and we'll go and get our friend Elizabeth who decided to stay in Largs for the day. Um, so definitely this was a, been a really good trip. I really enjoyed myself. So now I'm going to love you and leave you and I'll see you all on the ferry or just before the ferry. I'll see you. Well, we're now finished here on the island of Cumbria, Melport. Uh, we're just waiting on the ferry, which is on its way in. Um, I've really enjoyed today. I'm going to come back here in April and probably do another vlog, as you do. Uh, and I will ride around the island. Now, one thing we found out today, which is awesome, is you do not need to have you do not need to have a driving license to ride a moped scooter thing, a moped scooter around the island. Yeah, just on the island. Hiya. So, Samantha, what do you rate this island? Uh, about 8 out of 10. Would you come back here again? Of course, it's beautiful. I want to see the seals again. Yeah, the seals. Yeah, we saw seals. 
Um, so you would definitely recommend this for other people to come to? Definitely. Yep, I would definitely recommend it. So they do lots of festivals throughout the year. Um, notably, the most famous one is the uh, Country Western Festival. So I'm going to go now and get on the ferry and I'll see you all later. Yep, I think we are the only. I think we are the only people. Yep. No, we're not. There's people out from the bus. Yep. So this bus comes um, and meets people coming off the ferry and takes people from Melport to the ferry. And there are some cyclists, like just like us. Now I'm definitely coming here next time and going on a moped. Would you go on a moped around the island? The only downside is it's £10 an hour. If it's two hours, it's not bad. You should be able to get a decent amount of the island for that. Yeah, or at least go round it at least once or twice. Yeah. Time to say goodbye to the Isle of Milford for another day, but I'll be back in April. Definitely be back in April. Goodbye for another time.